Hello everyone, my name is Eric, but you can call me Blade Walker, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die, Darkness Falls. So, since uh, the end of the last video, I've went and done some resource gathering, and I completely forgot about that. And crafted a bunch of ammunition, all that good stuff. Somebody. Oh, like I already have some. Oh, wait, what? My non-concrete. All kinds of dang, I got a bunch of cute. So, whatever. Anyway, so I went ahead and uh, noticed that I had enough skill notes to craft another job, class, whatever. So I did so. And I've been looking at it and. And I'm thinking I'm going to take the. Uh, sec secure. No, not security. Survivalist. I forgot about that. Grapple look. So, I was looking at them, <clears throat> and both security and survivalist have uh, benefits to unlocking more uh, inventory slots, but it. but one is better than the other. And I... The security unlocks, the master security, is just the tactical rigging, the club, brass catcher, which, honestly, the brass catcher is already worthless to me at this point because I don't use weapons. Well, I mean, I do, but I'm already at the point where I technically could just dump those. So it seems kind of weird to lock that behind a master book, but whatever. But this is the one we're going to go with, and that's because it gives me the large backpack, but it also gives me the gunpowder bundle, which I guess technically is kind of useful. But the main reason is uh, I don't really care for Flurry of Blows. Pain Tolerance is good. Armor Specialist is good, but I wouldn't use it. But uh, the Survivor, I've been freezing to death in the cold biome and such. So I think this would give uh, would be nice. And then, of course, the Charismatic Nature makes trading better with bartering. Wasteland Treasures is essentially worthless. I Well, maybe not. Wait, wait, wait. I stand corrected. It increases a loot bonus. Well, okay, never mind. That's actually pretty good then. So yeah, we're, we're definitely going to go survivalist. Because, you know... And while we're uh, waiting for the horde to show up, because as you may have noticed, it is now day 28, I went ahead and uh, I crafted a new auger since I noticed we could make a uh, quality 61 and then I upgraded everything here to steel and then some quite a bit of it to stainless steel So that we are now ready for the horde Everything's been repaired. Everything's been upgraded. What I am doing right now is I wanted to make this a little bigger and then I don't know I have one Light bulbs no can I make one? I want to make a, a vulture defense because I keep forgetting to make one. And I... Not, oh, I could make a 4x4 four four if I wanted. Wait, why is first... First aid's under science? So can I make a... I cannot. SMG and shotgun. You stink. Alright, well, you know, what's this? Survivalist class. Uh, upon completion, plus one crafting tier to cloth, leather, scrap. Okay, so armor. Okay, that's nice. Let's see. Murky water plus three. Leather armor perk. Use point. Scrap it. Really? It doesn't give me any of the perks? What a complete ripoff. I feel like I've been... Oh, well. Let's put points in... Electricity. There we go. Now I've got the auto turret. Yes, yes, yes. Now we can make the good stuff. I want an auto turret, which I can't make because... Oh, I got a feeling he changed it. Probably have to make it... Made a ton of ammo. All right, all right, my all an auto turret. Hey, you. That's the mark two. 
Here we go. That's the one. Oh, we got to make it in the lathe. Is that what it is? That stuff. Okay. Oh, that's not. Oh, give me that stuff back, you goon. Does I need one of these? Must have been the girl, yeah. That means I gotta make the rest? Oh, what a ripoff. Alright, let me figure this out and then I'll bring you guys back. Okay, there's our turret. Means we. And I finished the uh, class quest real quick. It was just, it was a basically craft like level one stuff. It was so weird. What's also weird is that unlike the other classes, this one gave nothing. Didn't give jack. Rip off. Get anything? Oh, you know what? I'll take that. I'm going to guess disease resistance means one, only specifically infection, but you know what? I'll take a 20% increase the resistance to infection. Mainly, I want the insulation, heat, and cold because, good God, I'm tired of going into the snow biome and friggin' freezing to death. All right, so that should be that. Let's go and get turret defense. Oop. Get the turkey defense in. First things first, I got to remember to grab... Ammunition. We're going to take 600. I don't think we're going to need that much. But... Yeah, just never know. Oh, yes. I made a coil carbine. Carbon, whatever. And I put a full auto mod on it. Magazine extender, reflex sight. And, yeah. Pretty nice. And I definitely appreciate how fast it reads. Ahead and put this here. And then we're going to put our item here. Get this sucker wired up. Completely forgot to do this after for the last horde. And uh, it wasn't as bad as the A14, I think it was, but man, it was. Rough. Lock ammo. Don't want strangers right yet. I think they fixed that bug, but... Well, I don't think it was a bug, but they fixed it, but, you know. Well, I should probably just go ahead and do this now. If I don't, I'm going to regret it later. About that? Okay. Okay. You aimed kind of like that. Yeah, that should do it. Everything else looks good. I've already repaired all the bars. Ammo's in. Ammo's locked. Light is green. Trap is clean. All right, we're done. I already made sure to repair those. Yep, repaired. And repaired. All right, I think as far as I'm concerned, we are done preparing. Oop. We're done preparing for the horde. I think we're probably as good as we can or need to be. I just remembered I forgot to drop a bunch of stuff off. A bunch of extra ammunition. You know what? We've got multiple pairs. We'll just... I've got plenty of ammo. got Molotovs, explosions. I've got 25 more grenades on me. Now, I've got the crossbow, but did I forget to make explosive bolts? Because I could have sworn I had some. Problem is, I've been playing different mods and games, and I should say worlds, and I'm not sure what I have and haven't done. I guess I could bring the other... Um... I have a higher... Oh, God, I gotta sell some of this crap. Um... <laughs> got a crossbow, or... Might be better. But considering how this mod gives out... Well, not mod, game in general. Gives out high-level weapons like candy. 
I did get a rocket launcher uh, throughout the last in-game day. I did a bunch of uh, the... I quested a bunch from the scout because it's all low-level garbage. And I did get this level quality 32 rocket launcher, which was kind of nice. Heard the pulse grenades are... Heard they're deadly to you, the player. So let's find out. Apparently they are not deadly to me when you have uh, ill other players turned off. So you know what? We will take those. Got plenty of food, water. We got everything we need. Uh, so let's see about those weapons. Weapons. Yeah, ammo, that's what I'm looking for. We want explosion. See, so much inventory clutter. They explode. There we go. Pulse arrow? Ooh, that sounds it. I guess that's an improved version of explosive arrows and bolts. In, uh, disables demonic regeneration. Ooh, I definitely like that. Ah, that's right. Now, wait a minute. Didn't I make... I could have sworn I made some... Because I remember before, I was like, yeah, you gotta make the... Little air. Oh, you know what? I think I used them all, didn't I? Well. That is okay. Arrowhead. I don't know. 100, I guess. Can't auto loot from those. Um. Then. You have to make the actual arrows, which makes sense. I mean. That definitely makes sense. Plastic. Yeah, I'm out of plastic. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> uh. You know what? That's fine, dude. That's two minutes. And that will allow me to make the explodey ones. Really favorite those. Oh, I was going to say, I was like, what the hell? How many? I can only make two because... Plastic. Hmm, that is a problem. Serious problem. Well, at least now we've got those for later. I'm also super low on electrical parts. Yeah, so we need plastic and electrical parts. Oh, I did get... Enough hazmat fiber to make one piece of the mod. And I still have the ones I kept. I think I had three jackets, and that was it. So I kept the boots and the jacket, which is 40%, and then I can make one of the mods. So that would be 60%. So I need either. I'm going to guess there's only three hazmat parts there's the boots, the jacket, and the helmet, or the hat, hood. Yeah, that's kind of the only thing right now that's affecting our progression. But I think that's it. I'm trying to think. I don't believe we need anything else. I think we're totally ready for the hordes, so... I'm probably going to tool around here a little bit, and then I think I will see you guys when the horde gets here. Okay. Here we go. Got everything uh, repaired, modded up. Plenty of stuff. Ooh, I forgot about the... Give those a try. So, uh... See how this works. Wow, they're just like straight up running off the... Dang, this thing is super strong. We've got the most ammo of the generic 762, so I'm thinking we'll go ahead and use those first. 
plus it'll level up as that. As you see there, it'll level up our automatic weapon skill, which will make our coil rounds even more useful in the coil carbon. Ooh. Dang. Let's try these things here. I'm curious. Dang. I would say that's effective. Aha! Sounds like our turkey defense is working. Uh, I don't like explosions. Well, I do, just not when I'm not the one that made them. If I didn't make the explosion, I don't appreciate it. Yeah, you can definitely tell when you're playing on the easier difficulty, but... I hate playing on the easier difficulty, but if I don't... I'll get those demons real fast. And once the demons show up, I really lose interest in the mod pretty quickly. Not when they show up, I should, I should be specific. When they show up as sleepers. Because it makes just running, raiding POIs just not worth it. You end up going through so much ammo killing all the demons that trying to farm materials to make said ammo is pretty much just thrown out the window. But, I mean, come on, this is just ridiculous. This is way too easy. Die, piggy, die. That's okay. We need to enjoy these, quote, easy hordes while we can. Soon enough, we'll be getting... Oh, what is our... 95. Okay, yeah, we're still on the... Force, that's why I was like Alpha 21's game stage bonuses in the different biomes have become insane. again. Get another level up. Look at that XP bar move. Hey! Who spit on me like that? That wasn't very nice. Probably. Oop. There we go. Whoop. Not what I meant to do, but that works. Wow, we're getting a lot of skill up some automatic weapons. Hell yes. Let's see what our skill now is. Because when it gets to a certain point... Alright, when it gets to 60 and I can get the last point, I want to start working on the shotgun. Because the shotgun's already in the 50s, and it needs to get 60 to get the last perk unlocked. Another level up, damn. 
we're not even. We're right now at midnight. Two hours in, I've already gained four levels. That's wild. Man, I wish the M60 reloaded this fast in vanilla. Uh oh. Getting the creepy crap. Well, the good news is I think I had like 1,800 rounds of the uh, 7.62, and we've blown through those, so... Now, you might wonder why I'm not looting. It's because I'm going to put points into that looting skill here in a moment. Wasteland treasures or whatever. I want that loot bonus. Ah, stupid bird. Oh, I think it's time to... Oh, God, yes. Foil ammo for the win. Kind of wish I'd made more, but... I think that was a radiated dog. Well, goodbye, Mr. Bear. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure those are the radiated dogs, aren't they? Well, that's okay. I upgraded absolutely everything down below to stainless steel. So. That doesn't mean they won't destroy it. It just means they won't destroy it nearly as bad as it was when it was concrete or regular steel. Gonna take them quite a bit more work to get that destroyed. I feel like this should be absolute utter chaos, but somehow I'm managing. Well, I'm happy. But I feel like I should probably be panicking right now, even though I'm not. Ah, come on. There we go. Got you in the face. Wow, what is with the dogs? Damn. I was going to say, I was like, what's going on? Um, yeah. Like, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what was going on. They were hitting me because they weren't being zapped. I was like, what's going on here? I call shenanigans.
Man, there is an insane number of dogs. We are done with the shotgun now. Leveling it up, I mean, for the moment. Let's go ahead and back to the M60 and the... Wow, let's go ahead and just finish out using up all the good ammo, or the crack ammo. And then we'll worry about using the good stuff. Stuff is insanely good. Yeah, I saw you and I tried aiming, but I couldn't get him. Probably repair a little bit, but we don't really need to repair that much. Oh. Stupid loot bags, get out of the way! Thank you. Oh, did I just see a demo? I think I saw a demo, guys. I might have been hallucinating. I was not hallucinating. That was a demo. Oh, shoot. Okay, demos come earlier than 150 in Darkness Falls. They probably always did, I just don't remember. Okay, we uh, we officially have demolitions on a uh, demolition. Oh god. I got him. He must have drank some Red Bull or something. Oh, now that I see it. Come on. There we Freaking awesome. No! You... 
Oh, shit balls. Uh, mm, okay, I, I admit I did. Did he buff demo damage? <laughs> I think he buffed demo damage. Damn. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm wearing armor. What the hell? Wow, okay. Well, I mean, it was more or less the end of the horde anyway. That was wild. That was freaking awesome is what that was. We don't need any of that. We don't need that or this or that or that or that. Let's see. I honestly, I don't even consider that a fail. Truthfully, just because, I mean, we only died because I deliberately ran up and was trying to move. I, if I'd have realized that was, like, deadly, I definitely would not have done that. That was pretty freaking awesome. That should do, yeah, see, we still got tons of ammo, relatively speaking. Okay, let's see. We have six points, and we've maxed that one. I'm not worried about sexy T-Rex. Max that. Pistols I'd like to get up, but for now we're good. I got Boomstick Max, so that means the next one I want to do the Wasteland Treasures, I think. Yeah. 40% to the loot bonus, and then what's this? Oh, I got it. I'm really getting tired of that. Okay, so... Put this down here, put this down don't think we need this. We don't need that. We're going to go ahead and put the motorcycle down. It doesn't matter. I don't take damage from it, so I don't really care. I can't get that one off. Any more corpses? How did one fall? Die back there. Ooh, ow. Well, now that I think about it, yeah, I'm glad. Yeah, okay. Upgrading all this to stainless steel was absolutely the right move. Not that I thought it wasn't, but I was wondering how useful or whatever it would be, and looks like it was pretty darn useful. All right, well, we're going to do the usual. We're going to just kind of... In fact, I'm not even going to make you guys sit here. I'm going to loot everything, throw it in those boxes, and then I'll show you what we got. Okay, everything looted. We filled up quite a bit. Oh, yeah, almost three full containers worth of crap. Let's see what we got. Anything good. Lever action, dynamite... Recipes, a bunch of junk armor, ski goggles, suit pants. Quite a bit of food. Oh, super corn. Morange juice. Grass. Wow, an absolute insane number of healing items. Nougats. All right, that's pretty good. Next. Wow, a good chunk of ammo. That's nice. An advanced pistol? Hey! Useless now, but would have been cooler earlier. Junk batons. A P-25 receiver. Iron knuckles. Pump shotgun. Wow, lots of ammo. Steel knuckles, tack rifle, iron boots. In fact, I'm probably going to wear those. Some key cards. That's excellent. No red papers. Got another tool and die set. Don't need it, but it's nice to have. Orange marmalade is food. I always thought that was a drink, but nope, it's food, so that's good. Bit more armor, leather, another beaker, more treasure maps. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy. This is not bad at all. Magnum frame, a whole bunch of ammo, a bunch of stuff. Take the die out of that and then. Parts, more things, another lever action, iron boots, stone. Oh, stones, because when I was chopping the bodies, I kept hitting the stone. 
Six generic schematics. Okay, wow, that's a lot of tanning racks. All right, all right. Crowbar, iron fire axe. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Buffer coat. All right, so that's everything we got. And it looks like, I don't think a single block was actually destroyed. Lots of close one. Well, it broke 20,000. It's still got almost a quarter of its life, so that's not really even all that close. Wow. Yeah. Looks like not a single block was lost. That makes me very happy. So, that's going to do it for today, guys. Uh, not sure what we're going to do in the next video, but uh, we do need to get to the wasteland, which means we really need to start working on the hazmat fiber. If you guys have any hints or tips for where I can find that stuff more easily, feel free to let me know because I genuinely am not sure where the best places to find that stuff is anymore. Obviously, I've been uh, hunting down any and all hazmat zombies, and I've actually gotten a couple of pieces from them, but... Yeah, we've got enough for, we've got two clothing pieces, the boots and the body, and then I've got enough hazmat fire to make one mob. So technically that's 60%. That still means we need, what, 34? 36? 36 more hazmat fiber. Ugh. I'm going to start checking the uh, traders too to see if they've got them. But that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, feel free to leave a like or subscribe. Thank you all very much for coming and hanging out with me again today. And of course, as always, I will see you all in the next video. Have a great day, everyone.